What's up guys, TDA with another video. If you like these types of videos, please like, share, and subscribe. I really appreciate it. Also hit that bell icon so you can get notifications when I release new videos. So today's video is gonna be a review and install of the, the Ring Video Doorbell Pro. Um, this is the hardwired version and it comes with the, uh, the whatever the thing right there is called, what is that? The, I can tell you exactly what it comes with. It comes with the Ring Video Doorbell Pro, the Ring Chime Pro, Pro Power Kit, four removable face plates, a retro kit plate, a wedge and corner kit, user guide, security sticker, and installation tools and screws. So I'm gonna give you the quick specs on this thing. It's a uh, four and a half inches by 1.85 inches by 0.8 inches. Um, it works in negative five degrees Fahrenheit to 120 degrees Fahrenheit. Uh, it's power comes from existing wired doorbell with a minimum 16 volts AC transformer. And uh, it does have a Wi-Fi connection and it does have 1080p HD with 160 degree field of view. Uh, Two-way audio with noise uh, noise cancellation and a one-year warranty on parts and theft protection if your device is stolen we will replace it for free so that's pretty much it i'm gonna go ahead and get this out um i believe there is a battery that comes in here and i have to charge it so i'm going to pull everything out and i may not be able to install it until tomorrow but that'll be okay hope everybody is doing wonderful today all right here we go all right so this does come with a i guess this is like an instruction manual or something tells you about downloading the uh the app that's the instruction manual uh oh I guess this is your window sticker. Um, setting up the chime and retrofit kit. It's this right here. We may need that. I don't know. So right now I do have a doorbell on my house, but I'm going to change this one out. I want the black version. It comes with a couple of different versions it look like. All right, so this is it. Alright, what does this say? This says once you install uh, your Ring Pro, if the light at the top circle is flashing, your Ring Pro needs to be prepared the first time. This can take up to an hour. So they do recommend that you uh, set everything up prior to installing, um, installing it. So this one actually does not come with the battery. I thought this one came with the battery, but it does not. Let's see what See, these are installation tools. So I'm not going to open all this stuff because like it has a drill bit, a masonry drill bit. Um, a couple other things in here. So once we get into the installation, we'll look at all the tools. Uh, this is the chime, which plugs into something somewhere. And it has a couple of uh, base plates that you can use. Like I said, I want the black. Uh, oh, this is brown. So it comes with black and like a brown color and a tan color. And I believe this goes over. No, it doesn't go over. Oh, I guess you can take this piece. Okay, that's this piece right here. So, like, the, you can change it from the silver to the black to the white or the kind of, I guess, beige and then a brown color. But I may leave it with the the uh, the black or the um, the silver. That kind of looks nice. So, if you want to change that out, it just pops. It just pops out, and you can uh, change it. So, this version you can only connect this to. Uh, 16 to 24 volts 
AC. Now, I don't know what kind of voltage mine has. I'm assuming mine has um, voltage within that range, but we will see when we go out and install this thing. So let's get into the install. So let's start the install. So the first thing you want to do is check your power. Uh, I always check for AC as well as DC because you never know um, what you got there. Whatever. Just the old electrician thing. Um, it shows you which terminal points to go on to. There's only two. There should only be two wires on here. So you'll go under both the terminal points with the wires with the um this is some sort of power booster. I'm not sure exactly what this is um, because it this particular doorbell is already wired into a uh, a transformer. So I'm not, I'm not exactly sure what this is, but it says you have to have it. So you'll want to install it here. All right, you want to make sure you secure this to the side. It does have like a little uh, double stick tape on the side. Go ahead and st stick that to the side. Put your cover back on, make sure it's on there sturdily, make sure all those screws are holding it up tight, make sure you put all of your um, <laughs> religious tchotchkes back in place. And this is the, um, the chime. So the Pro actually comes with the uh, chime. I think they sell it separately for like $49.99, but this all came in one uh, package. I'll leave a link to it in the description section below. All you have to do is plug this in and it automatically comes on all right the next thing you want to do is um take your old doorbell off now it's very important and i should have said this before but you have to make sure you turn your breaker off for your uh for your doorbell because if you don't you probably get a little shock um it won't be much but you will get a shock if you don't turn it off um take that off and uh, take these screws off and pull the wire out now these wires are very small and fragile and if they've been bent once um, I'm gonna go ahead and say you probably need to go ahead and strip out more wire because if you don't you're gonna get it on the terminal point then it's gonna break when you're trying to put it back on there uh, that may or may not have happened to me but you won't see that here because the you know magic of movies um, so to strip this out, uh, you can either use just your, like your fingernail, you can use a knife, or you can use wire strippers. If you use wire strippers, it have to be the smaller kind that you use like on um, instrumentation or on cars or different things like that. Uh, after you get the wires hooked up, all you have to do is um, attach it to whatever surface you're going to. Mine was just wood, so I was able to use two of the wood screws that they included, and I attached it with my drill now drill this very slowly because if you don't you could break uh break the tabs off if you go in too far with the the screw so just make sure you just screw it in real slow and um and until it gets tight and if you want to you can um tighten it with the screwdriver install whatever color cover that you want to put on i chose the black in this instance i may ch change it out but i don't know it, there is a little screw that you do have to put in it comes in a separate bag and that just secures the cover onto it so this is it installed looks nice and it is awaiting activation so let's get to the uh phone so we can activate this thing all right we're going to open up the app and download the ring app i believe that's what it's called Yes, the ring app. And we will install it. Some of this is going to be taken out, obviously, because it's going to have my information. I can't give out my information like that. But uh, yeah, we use Face ID and un unlock that. Open it up. And the first thing you have to do, unless you have uh, another ring device, you will have to create an account. So go ahead and create your account, put in your home address. This is really a cool feature because whenever. Um, 
you sign in you actually join a network of your neighbors and you can actually get like updates um, from your neighbors I went through and scrolled through and there was a lot of uh, people reporting like burglaries and people stealing packages and um, different things uh, around the neighborhood so this is really good to know uh, you're gonna click on doorbells uh, you're gonna scan your QR code it comes with a um, just a, a piece of paper that has a QR code on it obviously I'm not gonna show mine here and uh, scan it and it'll automatically load it on there you do front door wherever it is um, so this is going to walk you through the installation of it, but we've already installed it. Um, mine is a mechanical ding dong. So if you, when you pulled your cover off of your actual in, uh, inside inside box, um, if you have like a little bell in there, that's going to be a ding dong bell. So you have to join your Wi-Fi network, and then you have to put in your password. I'm not going to show you all that, but it'll prompt you just to um, put in choose your Wi-Fi network and then put in your Wi-Fi network password and your setup will be complete so uh, I'm not gonna go through all the settings of it but I'll show you what the actual camera looks like on the phone itself um, and hi hey there I go ain't that a nice Hollister start shirt so as you can see I installed this at nighttime but it looks pretty good at night I think uh, I had my porch light on there but it looks even better actually with the porch light off it looks better um, because you can actually see there that's a creeper <laughs> um, so that's going to be it for today guys if you have any questions shoot it uh, a comment in the comment section below thanks guys for watching